Okay, so I've tried a few options with this now. Um, and unfortunately, I think I'm going to have to call it a day until I get the rest of my equipment in. My motherboard tester and stuff like that. Then, okay. I mean, if anyone else has got, um, can give me any information on why this could be doing this, then by all means, please let me know. Um, I have checked through all the wires, so P1, P2, P3, P4, P5. Uh, that's all I seem to be using at the moment. Um, but if anyone has any idea on how I could fix this, then that would be great. Until I get my um, my motherboard tester and the rest of my equipment in. Okay, little boy. Um, until then, I can't really do anything. But, yeah, um, it's not a failure. Um, we've got two very decent processors down there. Um, decent enough graphics cards, 16 gig of ECC. So, you know, um, if this does completely cock up, excuse my language, then I'll find something else. I'll probably replace the motherboard. Um, and then maybe replace the CPUs and stuff like that. But until then, um, until I get the rest of the equipment, I think I'm going to call it a day with this one and put it all back in its case. Um, but yeah, that's all. And thanks very much for watching, folks.